Well, hello everyone, I'm here with another LEGO Star Wars review, and also my first, uh, action battle type of set review. And this one's on the action battle hot generator attack set. So, on the front of the box here, you see LEGO logo, Star Wars logo, and that border that we've seen since the beginning of the year. And picture of a couple of shooters shooting at the targets, and the minifig selection below. And age recommendation set seven up. Set number seven five two three nine has two hundred thirty five pieces. And this retailing for thirty dollars and could it be worth it for thirty? But well, it's kind of there with uh, the uh, Hans Lance Hansel Landspeer set from twenty thirteen. And yeah, well, some of the other ones from this current wave and whatever. So on the back of the box, you see it in another position on like a wood tile floor in a sort of white color or whitish blue color, kind of interesting. And also, all the ammunition you get in this and the features of it. And yeah, and now on to the instruction booklet on the front of the instruction booklet, same pictures on the front and everything on the back. How to win on the online survey. All the pieces that come with the set. Add for the 20th anniversary sets, which I have previously reviewed. Add for the other action battle sets, of course. And then add for Lego Life. And that is it. Well, small for our mini figure is a snow trooper with a nice, good update to it. Also seen in the uh, Snow Speed 20th Anniversary Snow Speeder set. Like some good updates here and there, and just like in that, Angry Clone Face, or annoying Angry Clone Face, just give a plain black ad to come on, Lego. And next up is a, a Rebel Trooper, of course. And with some nice torso print and uh, mask and, or helmet and black goggles and all. Also, of which Reeves have been the same as they've often been for a little while now. And there he is from the back. And the face print of which also used in the uh, large uh, Hoth action battle set, which in which we'll review soon. And yeah. First of all, for the builds, you get this one. So you get this like smallish turn for the snow trooper. It kind of it does have, so it's supposed to be have the turn to it and. Also, some nice use of slopes all around, and a place to hold the gun onto. And nice is of the harpoons as stands, but in this thing, the top part is very loosely attached to with just one stud, which is kind of weak. But on but with the uh, shooters you use for this, you do, which are just the old school type of blasters that they've used for a long time. But with the later missiles they've added in. So the premise of this one of which. Or with this build. Mount your snow trooper into it. Take your blaster. And then shoot at it. Uh, it's supposed to come off. Well you do get four of the missiles in this set. Or let me do something. Uh, kind of hard to do it on this surface. There we go. it for that and on to the generator and this so which compared to the one in the uh, assault on hot set which does have the proper amount of uh, dish things for it which rather than three Probably maybe they weren't successful to make get all four in that set and the uh, 
target of which is the uh, rebellion sign compared to the empire signs in red on the other ones of which. Which, yeah, it's part of the action. And notice the light will turn base, which does wiggle back and forth, but easily falls off. Uh, which of uh, which is kind of part of the feature of the set. But once you like shoot it open, you do get some like uh, orange and yellow trans orange and yellow cones and studs in it to represent flames. But on the back, it is a quite bare bill, but a little clip to store the rifle on to it, obviously. And this turn is where you can like, place your rebel trooper onto it. And for its feature, do you get the same set? But you see, colors are a bit rearranged in like red or blue. This one, you can like press it and it's supposed to like knock the trooper right off of there. But we'll do it one more time. Hmm, doesn't work so well. Wait, let me try some. One more time. Well, at least you kind of get it anyways. Supposed to knock the trooper off the base. Was... So for the final verdict on this set is... This I think is a pretty good set. So it... Like, you get a Hoth generator, nice for a large Hoth mock if you're trying to do so. And also, probably in this whole thing of which, really good idea to, like, add some exploding features as something different in LEGO Star Wars. And, yeah, if you're looking for a decent action battle set or an action battle set to go along with the big uh, app, app one, then go ahead and get it. If you're looking to pick this one up, then definitely go ahead. And that's it with this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.